everyone, it's MK. Welcome back to MK Quilts. Today, we have more than your dynamic duo. So we got MK, we got Ellen, your normal dynamic duo, but today we're a trio. Allow me to introduce to you Ann Troutman. Ann is here teaching a class today, and we have some details about an additional class that she's gonna be offering. But before we do that, we have permission from the ladies in the back who are taking the class today to wave and say hi and hold up what you're working on today, ladies. Hi. Nice, uh-huh. Nice. We are working on a paper piecing today. A Quilt Works quilt by Judy Niemeyer. So, Anne, you are a certified instructor yes. with Quilt Works, right? Yes, I have been for several years now. Okay, wonderful. And she's been teaching classes here already, mm -hmm. and we're about to launch something brand, brand new. So, Ellen, let's let Anne explain first what she's going to yes. be teaching, have a few show and tells, Mm -hmm. And then um, we'll get Ellen to give us the details and how you can sign up. Okay, so yes. Anne, what are you going to be working on in this next class? We are going to be working on Carnival Flower, which is Judy's technique of the month. She comes out with it every two years. Um, and uh, it's only available through certified instructors or certified shop. I'm a certified instructor, but I can teach at MK's. Yay! Okay, so step aside a little oh. bit, Anne, so that they can see the uh, sample that you brought. That's the wall version. That okay. one is 80 by 80, which is the same size as the top of a king-size bed. So if you want to oh. put a long drop on it to do your quilting, mm -hmm. you see the whole thing. Awesome. Or you can do the queen, Okay. which is going to look, mine is going to look like this. Beautiful. This nice. is all out of grunge. Oh, grunge. That's fun. You guys instead have of, a lot of grunge. We have a lot of grunge, yes. And instead of batiks, because so many times we always see her quilts in batiks. So grunge. I like it. So I, that's why I did the grunge here, because I know what you guys have. Yes. This one is 99 by 99. So it's considered a queen. Um, I also have people that will extend this longer, the last border, just so they can make it really fit a king. All right. Mm -hmm. So it looks kind of involved, Anne. So yes. tell us about like how you're going to roll this out and how many class times and, and that kind of thing. Okay, this is done in eight sessions um, with a pre-session with me, and I will work with helping you pick your colors and where they're going to go in your quilt. As you can see, my first one I did only has three colors. Mm -hmm. This one has 12 colors. There's lots of variation you can do with it. Um, so we'll do the pre-class, we'll meet up with you, figure out what you want mm -hmm. to do. Then we will go and I'll have you cut all of your papers for class number one. When you come to class, class one, you're going to have your papers cut and in bags. You're so you're gonna, ready to go. So you're ready to go. You're not going to use your sewing machine the first time, first class. Okay, all right. But we're going to cut fabric. Everybody's going to get their fabric cut at the first class. Mm -hmm. Okay, so ahead of class, they can come on into MK Quilts yep. and choose some grunge, mm -hmm. and will Ellen mm -hmm. and I be able to help them with that pretty much based yeah, on I, a yeah, sample sheet some, that you... Yep, okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, awesome. Um, but also, anytime you've got someone coming in that wants to do it, as long as you text me mm -hmm. and let me know, or if somebody comes in, they're free to text me, hey, can you meet me? Yeah, yeah, because you're using the program so yes. they can see exactly what it's going to look yeah. like. We have a program called Quiltster. We can download fabric into it. I can color it. I can, you'll know what it looks like before you finish, even before you put your first stitch in. Okay. Yeah. So one other thing, Anne, before we get all the details and how you, how you can sign up. So it seems a little overwhelming. I mean, I'm taking today's class, but that seems overwhelming. But you've kind of broken it down into bite size manageable pieces, right? So just give them a little bit, and me included, how it's going to roll out over those eight class periods. Okay, so maybe for the first class, we'll work on the border of the queen. Okay, mm -hmm. so there'll be four pieces that look just like this. Yep. There's going to be four pieces that are the opposite direction of this, and then there's some pieces across in the middle. Okay, this so, is the border. This is all right. Look, okay, that's a straight seam. That's a straight uh, seam. Looks pretty simple so far. Okay. Yeah. So then, um, we may be doing something that looks like this. That'll be one unit. Mm -hmm. Still pretty straight. Yeah. Actually, yeah. all things considered. So, okay. Yeah. Okay. So this is going to have a right and a left. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, but again, in a month's time, 
to be able to do 12 of these right it's pretty achievable I mean, there's the papers are still on this one yeah okay then you have another one that look at those two little pieces <laughs> that's, okay that's so yeah. i'm even taking a breath all right wonderful so all of these are broken down into parts and pieces you can do this it looks overwhelming if you're looking at the whole yeah but when we break it down we'll be building it from the outside in mm -hmm. oh, as we interesting. get parts okay. done we'll start attaching them it's nice so you have like wedges of some yep. some shape exactly nice. all right so Wonderful. it's not overwhelming the last usually the last one, two classes most people have gotten absolutely caught up with all the piecing mm -hmm. and so we're just doing construction mm -hmm. so I've had beginner students who have taken a beginner quilting class and come in and done one of these quilts because they're broken down. Just breaking it down, yeah, awesome. makes it manageable. Awesome. Yeah. All right, well, as we're speaking about this, I'm thinking I know I'm going to get questions. This is an in-person in MK Quilts shop offering. Yes. So for, for the eight sessions, it's going to be here. All right, for my online folks, I don't have that for you yet in the way of these, this type of a piecing class. Never say never, we may have mm -hmm. that option in the future, but this is for locals. Okay, so Ellen, tell them the okay. dates, the details, and how they sign All up. All right, so for Carnival Flower, this being a technique of the month, mm -hmm. you're saying eight sessions, that means eight months. Mm -hmm. So we are doing the first Friday of every month. So our sessions are starting on Friday, March 3rd. And we have it basically an all-day session. Yes. It's, right? Yes. Nine to four. Yep. So nine to four. So basically all day. So even then oh, you're... nine to three. I'm sorry. Nine to three. Okay. <laughs> it's all day. <laughs> We're not <laughs> yeah. planning anything after yeah. three. Yeah. So Just saying. You're still sewing. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, but you're, you, that way you don't feel rushed yeah. either as you're going through right. it because you have the whole day to learn mm -hmm. the technique of mm -hmm. that section. Right. And then you have a whole month to do all your parts. Exactly. Of that section. Yep. And then you come back the next Friday. Now we have online listed all of the Fridays of what they actually right. are. Because some of them, because of the way the months are, we had to, to offset a little. Yeah, there's two Fridays within a month that, because the. Yeah, and holiday, yeah. So we had to offset a little bit, but online in the, the description, we have every Friday listed of what it's actually going to be. Now, because it's such a big class of eight months, we have the payment split into two payments. So when you're paying, you're first paying for the first four sessions. And then we said, what, June, July? Yep. You pay for the second half of the course. Yep. Wonderful. Well, I this is, I think, my second or third class with right. you, maybe. I think this is maybe my third. And I am getting more excited about paper piecing, which I haven't in the past. So it's just a really good opportunity to have someone like Ann here, professional, certified. She's really, she's teaching us as a whole, but she's going around and she's helping each one of us individually. And this is the way to learn it and do a big, beautiful quilt like that broken down into manageable pieces. Okay, yeah. so shop.mkquilts.com. What do they search for, Ellen? Carnival flower technique of the month. All right, so get yourself signed up and come and join us. Come and sew in the studio. Anything else, last final words? Uh, the pattern has to be purchased through me. Okay. Um, but, uh, and I will, as I find out as what each one wants to do, I'll get those patterns ordered. All right, wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, I got to get back to class, and Ellen's got to get back to whatever she was doing. A lot, a lot. Of stuff to work. <laughs> <laughs> and Anne's got to get back to teaching. Okay, you guys, we're looking forward to having you here in the shop for some paper piecing starting in March. All right, and this is how we do it. We go from our studio, studio. to yours. Happy quilting, everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>